Hi, I'm David Bell. Welcome to these tutorials on how to increase your creative output and share it wisely. I've got some exciting info to share. Info that will benefit you in two direct ways. First, it'll show you how to showcase your creative work. And second, it'll give you loads of insights into how others use KiwiConnection.nz and that can be very, very useful. Just before we begin, it really pays dividends to apply your learning as you go. So rather than finish a video tutorial and think about applying it tomorrow, why not do it immediately? At the end of each tutorial is a quick two-minute application for you to try. So welcome to episode one of how to use the KiwiConnection.nz ePortfolio. It's powered by Mahara, software version 1604, and that word Mahara is from the Maori language and it means recalling things to mind. Active reflection is the hallmark of creativity in every way, and here that's what we enable you to do. Actively reflect on theology and the gospel and church life, Christian thought and history, refining old ideas and creating new insights and sharing them with others. So let's begin by looking at a highly successful ePortfolio, which belongs to one of our most creative participants. When you first log into Kiwi Connection, you land at your personal dashboard. In another tutorial, we'll learn how to navigate and change it. Meantime, you need to learn just one fact. The most important page is actually your profile page. To find it, just go to the upper part of the screen and click your name. Click any name or personal photo and you'll always go to a profile page. Now, unfortunately, Demo Student 2 hasn't got a very interesting profile page. So let's find a friend for him and see whether he can, in fact, see a better profile page. So we'll search for Stuart. And a couple of Stuarts come up and we want Stuart Manans. We've gone to Stuart profile and over the years he's put an impressive output onto it. And in the series of video tutorials you'll learn how to enhance your profile. Give it a web presence. Very helpful for lay preachers, pastors and ministers. Display open badges and other awards. Create collections and pages and write journals that feed out as blogs. Meet friends around groups join night school and be part of live on air. You can assign permissions for viewing in and beyond your profile. But suppose you just want to be using resources rather than creating them. Let's go back to the dashboard for Demo Student 2. You can do that. Many of our participants are just there to browse the resources and use them and we welcome them for that. Kiwi Connection videos also appear in Facebook and Instagram, Google+, Twitter, LinkedIn, etc. But it's fair to say none of these can compare to the complete experience of a dedicated ePortfolio user where non-formal and informal social learning really happens. So here's your first application to try. When you next log into Kiwi Connection and you're at your dashboard, you'll see an open badge. Click it and read what it's all about. But don't apply for it just yet. If you want to go a little further before the next video, look at the profile completion tips. As these are ticked off, the badge starts to become available. Well, thank you very much for watching, and let's hope that as time goes on, you're able to do just that little bit more on your profile and turn it into something that's highly marketable, highly desirable, and your interest groups, your parishioners, your congregations will be very interested to see how you develop it. Of that, I am sure. See you next time.